Whoa, 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 whoa! What is that? Ah! Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the freak is going on? Sandy, no! Sandy, hold out! Stop, bro! What the? It's a lot of noise. We fall just a little bit. Like, how do I know I'm safe, though? Ticking coming through your headphones or out your speakers? Yeah. You know what that ticking signifies? The Jellion's end coming real soon. We worked our way through the copious obstacles of Bikini Bomb and we land ourselves very close to the end. Will this be the last episode? Well, I don't really know. I guess if you see the title and it says ending, then yes. But either way, guys, we are back for another episode of Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. Would you take a look? This map filled with locations once filled with horrors, but no more. Yeah, we better get to work, huh? So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to another episode of Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. We are closing in in the finale, and I do not want to waste time on this intro. We got stuff to do. Let's get it done. The last episode was really productive. I think we passed a total of three different zones within this, and we land ourselves now at Sandy's Tree Dome. And I don't know what the freak is going down here. Sandy, either way, we're coming to rescue you. Let's take a look at this good stuff. Oh, we play SpongeBob with a difficulty of just average. Let's get this started, but oh yeah. Did you do your like button thing? Thank you. All right, let's get it. Yeah, man, I want to waste no time for this intro. We got a thing to do. Let's get it done. Without the prince to command Jillian hordes to attack residents, the Jillian's influence decreases. The gang's taking this as an opportunity to locate the overlord's nest, but they'll need all the help they can get. While Squidward and Mr. Krabs visit a grieving Karen, SpongeBob and Patrick play a visit to... Play. SpongeBob and Patrick pay a visit to Sandy in hopes her technological prowess can save the day once again. Unfortunately for them, <laughs> it's hibernation season! Let's go! Oh, the whole dome is sealed up. That says keep out! We're going in. Still, I think. Hello, Sandy? Here we. Oh, dude. Sandy's snoring away. Look at the conditions, cold as freak. Well, it looks like Sandy's hibernating again. That means she made it out. Okay, why don't we check on no, her sooner? Because Mr. Krabs would fire Come us. On, you don't work for Mr. Krabs right now. <clears throat> That's what I said. I don't want to lose my job. What? Right, well, let's head back so we can find the cause of all what? this chaos. Oh no, the log froze. <laughs> oh good, I made sure to practice my craft this what? time. Open sesame. Uh, please? Patrick. <laughs> What a waste of a fantasy oh, book. No. Fish paste. Well, maybe we can find something to help us out. Otherwise, we're stuck here. Not only until spring, but until Bikini Bomb is in shambles. Or whilst, I think that said. Look, guys, my reading is bad. I want to get to the ending. Let's go. And we're here. Enter Sandy's tree. Patrick. Oh! That actually just made me jump, though. Now, I'm going to say it again. Thank you, everyone, for just supporting this series. I thought I'd end up playing one to do episodes on this thing, and that's where it would stay. But you guys wanted to see the full adventure of this crazy SpongeBob fan game, and man, what a thing to remember it is so far. Hello, Sandy. Hello. Yeah, we need your help. Oh, you left the front door wide mm. open. Wait, Patrick, remember the last time we were noisy? Uh, uh, yeah, she tore us to shreds. <laughs> Are we being noisy, though? We shouldn't run around up here. If she wakes okay, up... Okay, then I'll tell her you dirty Dan. I don't... What does that mean, though? I don't know. Okay, so we're not running into Sandy's tree. All right, interact. Let's go. Climb quietly. Ooh, you hear that warm fireplace blazing away? No running. Don't wake me up or else. Oh, she put that down because she knew we'd be breaking in here. Let's interact. Sandy? Oh, I see her. She's sleeping over there. What are we looking for? Find something to melt the ice? I mean, I would take the fireplace, but that ain't about to work. Hey, Patrick. You see anything, buddy? Yeah, okay, thanks for the help, you moron. Ah, uh, yes. Tr tree. So, I think we're probably looking for maybe a piece of wood or something like that. Let's take a look at Sandy. Uh, no, Sandy, you sound like you're sleeping pretty well. Uh, all right then. Let's open this door. Yeah, I think we're going to be trying to look for a piece of wood or something. Uh, this light source here, though. Can we take this? Let's take a look. Uh, we can. Okay, check back here. What the freak we got? I see a robot in the corner. How about we go ahead and assess this? Hey, bud. Time to wake up. Wait, there's something glowing in here. Don't go running. It looks like a blueprint. Let's take a look at this thing. So, okay, that's a weapon of some kind. See, Patrick, look, Sandy was building a flame oh, door. Oh, yeah. You reckon we could build it, SpongeBob? Right. Sure. Let's start off with the hairdryer. She's going to have one around here somewhere. Search for the blueprint component within Sandy's tree. But if we don't run, there should be no issues with this, right? Unless maybe there's dangers outside. Yeah, like... I can walk for as long as I want, guys. I see no issues. She's snoring so loudly, bro. Like, I don't even got to think about this. You could literally, though, just take a piece of the log that's on fire, hold it to the door. You probably got yourself a solution, but SpongeBob and Patrick, they think, how about we go ahead and build a flamethrower that we got no idea on how it's built, though? So do we go outside? I assume we got to. I, can we run now? Like, Sandy's probably not going to hear this, right? It's good so far. Let's get searching, then. We got a picnic table here covered in snow, and we can't move that. Okay. Oh, man. I can see myself getting lost in here real quick. 
Like, there's so many different twists and turns. Like, do I even gotta do this, though? Oh, wait, search for the blueprint component within Sandy's tree. So, why are we outside? All right, so let's go ahead and do this. It's definitely up here. Even though it says naught of eight, like, that's a lot of different components we gotta find. Damn, boy, he's there. Let's take a look. Oh, okay. Now, we just find the gun straight up. Yo, that feels good. That's the hairdryer. Visit Sandy's bedroom to melt the ice from the hairdryer. This feels like the calmest mission so far, right, guys? There we go. Okay, bring the hairdryer to the blueprint. So this is how we begin building this. Maybe we then got to use this blueprint to help us out significantly. All right, throw this thing down. Let's go. <laughs> one of eight. And there, that's one piece oh, down. Yeah. But only seven more to go, yep. right? Barnacles, that's right. I didn't see any other pieces here, so they must be out. <laughs> okay, let's build this thing. <laughs> what the freak was that? There was something moving at high velocity around here. Find all of the flamethrower blueprint components to build the flamethrower. Hey, who was running around there, though? I saw something, and I didn't like it. Well, we're going downstairs, so whoever's up here, see you, sucker. Guys, what's the danger around here, though? Can I run? Like, I legit have no idea, though. Okay, that's Patrick's footsteps. No worries. So we're out here doing our thing with nothing to worry about. Our imagination's running wild, and that's all that's happening. Right, guys? Yeah, I know. It's bullcrap. Oh, what's this down here? Look at this cave system. I mean, I don't hear any monsters, so do I gotta be afraid? Guys, I'm gonna run, because I'll be here all day otherwise, and maybe we gotta die to get that hint in terms of what we don't do next time round. So for now, let's be confident. You know, we find the different components, and we then simply get out of here. Well, I mean, I'd love to if I could find these components. Wait, what's this? It looks like a component, right? So take that. Oh, here we go. So I'm guessing these things get dotted around the map as time goes on. They throw Ooh. it down. Uh, don't you need to melt it first, SpongeBob? Wow. Every single time we gotta defrost these things. Okay, well, we'll do that and then we'll use it. And there we go. All right, throw it down. So now we probably go back outside again and find another part which spawns in one of the other locations. So it's a lot about checking the same spots more than once. I think that's gonna be a reoccurring theme for this. Also, I don't understand what was running before. Like, we saw it run once and then we never saw it again. I don't understand what we've bad witness to. Like, do I gotta poop yet? Do I have to be scared? Are we safe? All right, here's part three. Uh, cool. Wait, did I hear a door open? Hold up, what? I definitely just heard a door open the- <gasps> Bro, what the heck is that? <gasps> oh my gosh. Uh, where's he going, where's he going? Patrick, can you duck though? Oh my God, look at this acorn head. <gasps> oh my gosh, I don't like this, I don't like this. Oh, he's coming our way. Oh, he's coming our way. Don't see me, don't see me, duck. Holy crap, this is sketch, dude. Does he know I'm here, though? Guys. Ah! Bro, is that the enemy? I'm down. I'm out. Is he stalking outside, too, or strictly, like, only when we go back? That actually... Oh, he's stalking me. Wait, what the freak? So he doesn't chase me, but maybe he builds up speed over time or something? Okay, so we don't have to worry about him directly seeing us. It's more the fact that we have to be careful. Um, he has, like, a timer on him, so I don't know if we're going to be timed as we do this. We've got to be very, very wary, though. Let's just pay attention to that, and we should be good. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is that? Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the freak is going on? Sandy, no! Sandy, hold up! Stop, bro! What the... Why did my man do that? Yeah, look, he's gone from the corner. Dang. Also, this line here, we have Ooh. to run. Oh, bro, come on. We got to mount this thing too. Very quiet robot, though. Very, very quiet. Be ashamed to bump into him behind one of these doors, you know? Can I take more than one at the same time? Nope. Are you kidding me, SpongeBob? You got one hand literally pointing at things. Why can't you use that to pick things up, man? Like that sound there. I don't know what that means. It, it probably means it's active, but it burrows so quickly. So I don't really know how I can avoid it. Is it maybe me running, triggering it? If I stop running though, maybe it'll get me. I, like guys, I don't know. Take this, take this. Now keep your eyes peeled for the little uh, robot thing. Uh, let's go on the hill. I don't see it burrowing or doing any of the stupid crap it does usually. Let's take a look here. Now I don't see it. Maybe we're good for this one. Wait, you hear that sound again? It sounds like heavy up. Okay, Wait. Now you Okay, look, I hear the sound. It, does that mean he's out, though? Because if I got eyes on, I could probably avoid. Okay, so there he is. He is out and walking. Now, if I take this, okay, lead him this way. I don't know why he borrows, though, sometimes, because that just completely defeats the whole point of getting around him. Oh, oh, you see him, you see him there. So he comes through. Let's hurry up with this one, okay? Place that one down. All right, now, where's this man coming from? Because I gotta go the reverse way. I think he knows I'm here. Oh, he's playing pranks, he's playing pranks, guys. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at this. How the freak do you avoid this? Patrick, move your belly, bro. Dude, he's right there. I gotta run, I gotta run. Can't slow down, slow down. Uh, like, he would have got me before, right? But I'm just... Dude, I'm going free. Let's go. Uh-oh, he's borrowing. So, is it better to just go back inside at this point? Like, lure him back in. Like, if I go in... Hold up. I don't know. And if he comes through the front door, I'm dead again. Just take it. So you hear that? He came through somewhere, but where? Right? Let's kind of, like, stand cover back here. He's probably going to appear by the door. Good evening. Oh, he's over there. Oh, he had no idea. Okay. Let's take a chance to go. So we lured him back inside. Let's try and find that fourth piece. I'm not having much luck, though. Okay, I found the fourth one. Let's go. Okay, it looks like the lighter. Okay, I see him. He's way over there. Oh, is he, like, maybe following my last trail? Because if so, that gives me more of a chance, I guess, to plan. We'll take a listen how quickly he comes back in the house, though. I'm the frost side. I couldn't tell if he came back in the house then or not. He might have. He did. He's so snappy. Like, the moment you do something, he's instantly back on your tail. Let's go. Yes! Thank you, game. I was worried about checkpoints. Now I know, and I'm a bit more happy about this. I didn't think we'd pass this one anytime soon. So we could die. Look at you, bro. <laughs> Closing yourself on the other side of the door. What a moron, though. I just didn't twig, though. We heard about those things being bad. I don't know if the robot now snaps more to that location. Take a look back there. What the freak? Where'd he go? Oh, look, he's running. Woo, he's picking up the pace. Okay, part five. Looks like some kind of stick. What? Are you serious? That's blocked off. Oh my gosh. Why? Why can't we just move that? Like destroy it or something. You know what I'm saying, guys? This is going to make things really complicated. No way. So defrost that. Look, he's coming my way, though. What am I supposed to do? Like, juke him around the sofa slowly? What the... Bro. Wait, what? What are you supposed to do? So the game talks about potential escape routes, but the one escape route is gone? Wait, hold up. There has to be some way of escaping. Can you, like, jump out the window? No. Nope. I can't. So if I'm cornered, I'm dead instantly, but he always knows where you are. Oh, my gosh. How? Like, how do I actually avoid him? Let me try and defrost this. I'll try the sofa thing one more time. But he's always right there. I don't understand this. Bro, who the freak are you? What's wrong with you? Go away. I leave the door. He's going to get me in a direct line of sight. Okay, he didn't respond yet, but he's just going to stalk me down, correct? Okay, part five. Oh, this mission is the worst. I am actually not going to like this one. I'm worried. If he, fl if he, like, flanks me now, I'm screwed. Okay, why didn't he flank me? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out also if he follows the exact path that you take around this thing and then he stalks you down. Like, he always follows you once you go back outside, but maybe we just got to be a bit quicker with this. Here's another part. Okay, we see that. Watch those twigs. Oh my gosh, he's getting quick. Like, he's getting... Look at that, he's borrowing. If he keeps borrowing, he's just going to get me straight up. Frost that. So where's he cut? Same situation, huh, fella? Same situation as before. He cuts me up. He cuts me up. I don't understand this. I really don't get this, though. Oh, my God. He jumped through the window. He jumped through the window. What? Why did Frost this? It's like, look, he, he like, sees me on my line of sight. If I run and then start walking here, like, am I good? Why isn't he getting me, though? He's like, he doesn't care. I don't understand this. Maybe there's something in the episode where we see this guy that I'm missing. Like, if I watched the episode, I'd understand his mechanics a little bit more. Dang, my brain is not functioning right now, clearly, for what the situation is. It's part six. What the freak did you just do to me, huh? All I heard was that scrape. So if I stop running, let's go. So, what the freak do I do at this point here, sir? You block the door off. Let me just see where he goes. So, he's coming around this way. All right, maybe we lead him down here, and then I just, like, give him the, the casual juke, like, like this or something. Oh, my gosh, this is going to be horrible. He cuts me up, too. No way, man. This is insane. I mean, it worked, but I could see something going wrong one of these times. And when it does, oh, man, it ain't going to be good. Quick time. I don't know where the seventh piece could be. I've looked everywhere, guys. I'm running out of locations where I think I might find them. Uh, we'll run around the outskirts here and just cross our fingers and see if something lands up in our path. Okay, I'm seeing twigs there, so we don't want to go that way. That's one way we do not. Look, he's right there, dude. He's right there, and he's very quick. So what now, huh? What now? And he borrows. If he borrows, does he not go quicker than me, though? Okay, there's a seventh part here. Uh, I don't know if the burrow directly follows me again. Oh, oh, he unborrowed right there. You see that? Let's try this. Uh, guys, I'm really not looking forward to this. I'm really, really worried. So we'll walk the normal way. If he's quicker in the house too, then we've got a big problem. You already hear him, like, coming through stuff. 
Okay, he didn't come through that window, but yeah, he's definitely getting much quicker. You can hear it. I lead him down, lead him down. So I'm gonna stand like here. I'll wait for him to pass a certain point in the sofa. All right, let's go. About now. Yes! We should have enough time. Oh, he cut back. He cut back. He's cheating. He's actually cheating. Wait, no, he didn't. All right, seventh part. There we go. Okay, so... I still don't know the 100% best strap for this. I'm leading him down here, then kind of giving him like a casual juke. So, excuse me, Patrick. Here we go. He's coming. He's coming. All right. No, 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 no. This way. Bro, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Okay. He's gonna probably see me. Oh, this sucks. I don't know why this is working. I really don't, guys. I'm gonna be honest. Right, where could the eighth part be? I, I don't even know. I'm gonna check towards this side here and hope that we find it. Just hope. Wait. Bro, I got it. Where's my man? If we find my man, there he is. There he is, there he is, there he is. <gasps> this might work out. I just gotta be very careful here. So there he is. I think he Oh, he's cutting corners now. He's definitely cutting corners. Let's go around like this, maybe? I don't know. I'm gonna try and see if I can cut around the house real quick. Don't borrow into me. I didn't see him. All right, I gotta unfreeze this, though, and then we're done. Please don't do some weird stuff. I don't know why this is working, but I like it. He's in already. Where's he in? Is he in here? <gasps> he's not. Okay, so let's do the same thing again. Please work for whatever reason. I don't get it. There we go. So we dissolve that. Now... Come on, robot. Play fair. You you know, you do your thing and I, I'll escape. Now, let's go. Okay. Oh. Oh, yeah. He's taking the long way around. So, in theory, once we get the flamethrower, we should be able to get this done. And then we're just out of this for uh, good. Please give me a checkpoint, though. Don't hit me with a weird mechanic and then slap me on the booty cheeks when I mess it up. Here's that eight of eight. Here it is. Let's go. Boom. That sounds like a checkpoint. It better be. Okay, so we... What? What? Mount off the... <gasps> Are you serious? We're not done, though? Oh, my gosh. Guys, I don't like this. I really don't like this. So, all right, Patrick, let's go. Let's go. I don't know. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. He didn't alert her. So once we get out of here, we just run for the door. It's a straight line. And then we hope that we win this thing. I don't see why we wouldn't. If the game doesn't give me a checkpoint, though, bro, that sucks. That sucks. So the front door, I can already see it. It's right there. Come on, Pat. Let's run. I see it. It's in my line of sight. Don't stand on those. Let's get it, buddy. Woo! Let's go, Patrick Mel. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. Okay, come on. Wait. Let's go. Yes! Oh my goodness! Leave the tree dome! Keep out, we should have never went in! What? Crat! The sock is still froze! If I get jump scared after all that. Oh my barnacles! Yeah, Sandy's chasing them down. Let's take it to Oh my god! So we could have done that from the get-go! Patrick. You know what? I ain't even gonna make any remarks. We got out, didn't we? <laughs> Continue. Get me back to the cross crab. I want Krabby Patties on deck. I'm hungry. I'm tired of this mess. Let me see. No Krabby Patty, but what the freak is this? No, look, literally, what the freak is this? It doesn't even tell me. All right, well, we've done everything but the last location. I figured there might be something popping up in the middle here. Let's go. This is it. Do you want to proceed? Woo! I clicked that without thinking. This is it then. This is the final ending for this. So we take this down. We're done with this. We learned the mysteries of what was going down here. Yes. Let's go. All right. Here we go. The crusty crabs. So SpongeBob and Patrick come back. We got the flamethrower. I miss the crabs and Squidward there though. <laughs> they are. And they've got the goods. Where is Sandy? Oh, hibernation. Yep. Hi. Mr. Squidward, care to explain Karen's gizmo? Uh, Supposedly, this can find large quantities of the jelly and goo. Meaning, we can find the uh, But does wife agree to aid us under the condition that we bring that shrimp back alive? Why don't you give him a proper demonstration? Sure, I guess. Oh, we see the sonar beeping up. Huh. Is this thing busted? Of course not. Let me see. Is this saying that we're close? Is it getting closer? <laughs> Don't be silly, Mr. Squidward. Yep. This just simply means the source of our problems been right here under our noses. Uh -oh. oh, aura above us. Uh -huh. Oh my god, guys, that's a fear burp right there. Uh -huh. Oh, we need to put some fresh air. <laughs> oh, he's back! <laughs> he fired bubbles at us! Oh, they brought the whole gang. Uh -oh. This is not good, though. I can't even tell what's happened. They're being called the Recon Group. All over the Krusty Krab. Oh, we have lived off! Dude, they're about to take us out of the water at this rate! We've fallen back. He's bringing out the cash. 
<laughs> that's scorching me, boy. Roast those blasted and tentacles. I've got your poop deck. All right, you overgrown paddy tubbin. I don't know what cesspool you're scoring out of. Oh, you heard that one. Aye, you cockswain. It's one thing to ruin me livelihood, but you're dancing with catch for me daughter's disappearance. Come have a taste of some hard boiled crap, you village rats. Why are these insults? I like them. Right, here we go. Wait, if you want. Call of Duty. Black Ops. Oh, you know this, you know this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Boom. Oh, yes. Guys, just stand down. It's an easy done deal. Look at this. Popping shots, no problem. Hey, Pat, you keep on that, yeah? Right, as long as we land our shots, we're good, guys. Look at that. Land some shots. That's it. So we're protecting Patrick. Oh, you guys trying to block my vision? Too bad I could shoot blindfold and I'd be landing shots. Look at this. Oh, time to spray and pray real soon, guys. Oh, my. Woo! There's a lot coming through. Hey, back up. Bro, what's going on? I need... Why is my gun shooting? Holy crap, this is insane, this is insane. Take out these ones, they blind us, they blind us. Alright, let's go. Fire, fire. Ooh, they're coming for us now, you see that? His house is going. How are you boys? Ah, he's got my lines! Wave two begins. Sure. Yeah, alright, he's holding off there now. Alright, let's go, let's go. Bro, what the freak is that? Holy crap. Let's go. So these ones come for us, and these ones we gotta defend Patrick with, I guess. Let's go, let's go. Woo! Oh, they're coming in. Oh, no, no, no. Don't let him get it. Cool down, gun. Come on. I can't fire, though. Right, here we go. Here we go. Woo! This is getting insane. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Go. No way, Patrick. I can't shoot, though. Look. It won't let me shoot. It's all about those group shots. Okay. Come on. We've got to let the gun cool down a bit. Come on, group shot. That's it. Look at that. Two for one. Two for one. Woo! All right. I don't want to spam anymore, but at times I feel like I have to. Like now. Look at this. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. All right. Save him, save him. Look, dude. I'm, I'm literally pressing the shoot button. Bro, this is bad. This is really bad. Unless, of course, wave two is it. Uh-oh. 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 We're in trouble. My gun overheats again? What can I do? All right, this one's much better so far. It feels like if you shoot them as they fall, you get, like, group hits. That's what you were like. Look at that, dude. You see that taking that multiple? Come on, let's go. Let's go. All right, let me see. All right, so we fight this dude one more time. We might have enough shots to take him out straight up. One more. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I see you. I see you. I see you. Uh, okay, I see nothing now. Wave three begins. Okay. We're getting somewhere here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. No. Save some shots, save some shots. Look at that, go for the wave, go for the full wave. Multiple shots at once. All right, I see that. Oh, let's go. Oh, yes, like that, like that. Yeah, I like that splash damage. That's what I like to see more of. See when they fall down. Oh, that don't sound good, I don't like that. Well, let this recover. We're in full house still, I've just seen that. Hold up, let's go. Oh, I'll take those ones. Okay, no, 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 no. Woo, that was close. Take that one out. Hey, come on, you gotta wind down a bit, man, come on. Hit that. All right, let's see. Two more. Splash damage. We gotta cool off. We gotta cool off. All right, leave that guy because he only blinds you a bit. Now we take him out. Okay, let's go for splash damage. Woo! I can't see anything. Holy crap. Okay, shoot. Come on. Let's take shots. I can't see still. We're still good. No hits, pretty much. Oh, let's go. Let's go. You see that wave coming up now, though, guys? Get those group ones. Ooh, cool down. Cool down. Let's go. Kill all at once. Kill all at once. I think. Okay, we gotta cool down. You can wait. You can wait. And one more shot there. That's the full wave. Oh, and then we take out this guy at the back. Woo! Let's see if we can get that perfect run. Okay, shoot you. Let's go, let's go. Okay, uh, I think we're doing this then. Oh, the gun, you gotta cool down. Is there no quicker way to cool this down? Hold up, what are we looking at? What are we looking at? Okay, he's doing that. We only took one hit. Hello? Oh my, what the freak? But how? Dude, look, we got more coming in. I guess we just keep landing shots like this. Keep landing shots, I think. Uh, this is bad. I don't want the gun to overheat, though. We can leave him for a bit. Okay, I'm firing. Look, the gun's got to cool off, though. Like, I can't even shoot. Okay, you can go. Come on. We're hurting him. Okay, it sounds like we're doing good damage, right? One more here. Okay, now let's land some more. Bro, can you seriously not? Guys, I'm really shooting a lot. I'm not even focusing on those guys. I think I got him. Oh, no way. No way. Okay, okay, you got to cool off. Come on. Let's go. I can't even see anymore. Now we've got to clear the screen a bit. We should be fine. Let's just land these shots. Oh my god, those dudes too. Here we go. I'm looking around for anything that might come at me invisible. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. We're screaming, but we made progress. Oh, please. That feels like a check. Oh, we're falling. Oh, oh. Hold up, hold up. I just saw the Krusty Krab in about 36,000 different pieces. Did I see that right? Because that ain't good. Oh, man. Yeah, Mr. Krabs, that cash you've been saving for 12 years, this is what it was for right here. Look at his standing back. Well, this isn't the first time the Krusty Krab's been blown to pieces, but, well, I can't help but feel bad for Eugene right about now. Speaking of which, where is he? Bro, is he blaming us? Straight out of the bus. 
What the freak? Oh, no, no, no. This is a limited capacity yeah. bus, boys. I'm not dealing with another freak accident with those two idiots. Let me relieve you of your duties then. Oh, oh he straight up gave him the throw it out. Yeah. See, Weasel? He just abandons him there. Wow, they don't even pay their fees. We're chasing them down. Eugene, the road. The road's slow down. You don't need a road right now. Eugene knows that. Where are we headed, though? This don't sound good. What a ruckus. Down at the bottom of the ocean. Ow, oh, my aching tentacles. Yeah, and that's not the only thing that's going to be aching by the time we're done here. Let's go. When you're ready, talk to Mr. Krabs to approach the museum. Let's look around here in the meantime. Wait, what? I feel like I remember this. Mmm, kelp nougat crunch. Yeah, delicious, right? Delicious. Let's uh, take a look, see if we can uh, operate that. Nope. We can't. Yeah, you see him standing there. Look, he's just got his eyes right over there. Is there anything more? We're at the bottom, though. You see that rock bottom? You know the episode, guys, where SpongeBob keeps missing the bus? Oh, I remember that one. Let's not keep Eugene waiting. Look, he's got the rifle. <laughs> Let's speak. All right, I think it's time to go after that thing. <laughs> Eugene? His uh, mind is gone. Do you still have that camera, Mr. Squidward? Yeah, I'm pretty sure oh, Patrick... Yeah. I need to use it. What's he about to do? Start vlogging this situation? Uh... We walk off and go and get it, I assume. And Eugene just stands there with the rifle. Here we go. <laughs> Do it. What's he doing? No way. No <laughs> way. Do we have to sneak? Aye. She's no clone. Just a wretch taking advantage of the plight. This weapon won't protect us, but that camera. No. Oh, no. Yeah, that's me. Good luck, Mr. Squidward. Our lives are in your hands. Oh, I'm not a fan of this. I hate this stuff, dude. So, we gotta sneak on through. We got a camera. Uh, where are we going? Take a picture? Okay, we snap a picture and move. So, what are we exactly looking to avoid? Like, I don't see anything. Let's take another picture. It's a lot of noise. We fall just a little bit. Like, how do I know I'm safe, though? What the? Okay, so listen for rumbling sounds. It says scare it off. Is it this side here? Okay, so that counts. All right, let's go. I ain't gonna slow down. There's no point. Maybe there's more enemies though? Oh. What the freak is that? Bro, hold up. What the, what am I supposed to do? What the freak? It's right there. I don't understand what's going on. All right, she's there. I'm literally, I'm going on the sand, guys. I'm going on the sand. Look how wide I'm walking. Okay, I'm walking wide. I'm getting back on the path. Okay, we're here. I see my surroundings. Holy crap, that's menacing. Hey, hold on. There it is. Okay, go in there one more time. Woo, let's go. You know, this is giving me those, like, FNAF How Wanted vibes. You know, if this thing wasn't VR. I think we're safe then to walk up to the next, like, arrow. Maybe? Okay, so then we wait just to be safe. It's not She's there. Oh, boy. So we go all the way around here. I'm going to walk for quite a while here, guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Okay, there's the arrow. Let's get back on track slowly. Here we go. And I'm probably... Yeah, I'm not even going to pay attention. Okay, I'm actually going to go around here quite wide. Okay, keep eyes on this. And then look for the arrow when we see it. Okay, I don't... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, we'd, be, we'd be patient, guys. We'd be patient. Just to be safe. Look, with the still little checker marks. But we can see in front... Okay, there's no enemy. I'm going to let this thing charge up. I'm playing this very safe. Let's go. I'm ready, just in case. I am ready. Look, there's still more arrows. I don't like this. I don't like this, bro. I, wait, are we good? I'm here. Yo, let's just start running. Let's go. Boom. Oh, yes, we made it. That didn't feel right. That felt really sketch. <sighs> Watch your raft, Squidward. Whatever that means. Oh, okay, so he's keeping the doors held shut, you see? He's closing them like curtains. And we all move up the gang. <gasps> let's do this. We're on rock bottom. So this is where the main colony's been hiding out, ha! Huh? Yeah, I'm kind of scared too, Patrick. Please don't set an example for me, though. I'll copy. Oh, even Mr. Krabs don't sound too confident. Uh-oh. Dilated pupils. Wait. Hold up. No way. Is that what I think it is? <laughs> that one just fell straight down. Oh. Look at ya. A big goopy mess. Yeah, you want to mess with us? Let's go. Did anyone think this far? Arr, I sure did. Oh, we got this off. Whoa! Oh, he turns back. Only to the face is he hurt. Otherwise, he, like, absorbs it. Does anyone else have yep. any ideas? Wait, Jellyfish reacted music, so... Uh, they're whispering. What we got, guys? What we got? Hold up. Keep out. Hey. Woo! Looks like they made it safe and sound. SpongeBob. Shh. It's going to be okay, Pat. I don't know about this one. Come on, we got to do something here. But what if... What if you... I'll be fine on my own. I promise I won't let them get me. And whatever's on your mind, it'll be okay. You can trust your best friend, right? 
Oh, this is kind of like an emotional <laughs> moment. Okay, SpongeBob, I trust you. I feel awful if I never get the chance to. Oh, I heard that yelp. What the freak is happening? Where's he been put to? Ah. Uh, Oh, I don't like any of this. It's a guitar. Oh, hey, guitar. <laughs> SpongeBob needed one of them for the plan of his. Okay, so. <laughs> after all this time? Finally, after hours of running after you, I'm here at last. You thought you could best me? I was merely out of my prime. At this moment, however, I'm gonna get that promotion. How about me? <sighs> you hear the vengeance in his eyes? Yeah. Come on. You know, I think Mum's calling me for breakfast. Was a nice chat. See you around. <laughs> About time. So Dennis is back. Oh, do I know you? No, but I'm well aware of your identity. To be honest, I figured you wouldn't be this idiotic. You all delivered yourselves to my client. All I have to do is kill you. Can this game stop dropping things Whoa. on our heads? Oh, it's Doodle Patrick. My, that was drawn out of proportion. Get out, bro. Oh, it's Evil Doodle again. Evil? Nonsense, my good <laughs> man. We're here to deliver piping on justice. What'd I do? I'd never thought you'd ask. Play me a somber tune, Bob. Wait. We're going back in time? Allow me to recount the tale from Bob's perspective, if I may. After you reclaimed the Dutchman's ship and thwarted my peaceful negotiations, I bought Bob enough time to craft a space vessel and to take him straight to the moon. Of course, your blasted doodle creation, Doodle Pants, insisted on tailing him. A chase through the colonized planet later and a battle commenced between Pants and Bob. Even when absorbed by Scribbles, he was not able to best Pants. And when they had him pinned, they changed him. Bob agreed to make peace with you sea creatures in exchange for Pants. For years, Doodles peacefully survived in the moon. That is until disaster struck. A freak accident occurred, wiping out the populace. Bob survived, thankfully, but Pants was nowhere to be found. When Bob returned to our dimension, he came to a common agreement. You Neanderthals caused our downfall. Many months of preparation were cut short when we were transported into your dimension. Admittedly, we have to improvise. This voice is literally making me go lightheaded. I gotta take breathers. Attempting to murder your friend isn't as easy as it looks. However, the convenience of this invasion was the perfect chance to prepare. We've taken the very essence of the clones right under your noses. Oh, that brings us to this scenario. Mario, old chum, to prevent further failure, we need to erase you, all of you. I'd like to give you a sporting chance to run away if you'd like. My man's hitting the Z's harder than his story. Oh, why boof? Oh, with the pencil? Anyhow, let's expedite this process. He wants to square up. Patrick, you got the boxing gloves? Doodle Bob's on our side? Bob, my boy, I can't quite reach him. Mind moving yeah. over? Yeah, oh my, oh my, my. Bob, why are you defending these heathens? They're responsible for our kind segregation. Why, they're the cause for your internal agony for pants. A sick twisted joke it is to make you a friend only to annihilate him later. Despicable. Come, Bob, let's return the favor to that sponge, starting with that yeah. drooling monkey. He's holding his yeah. ground, no way. Patrick, friend, you not. I understand, Bob. You've been overwhelmed emotionally. That monologue, your piano playing, I know it's a bit munch. I'll show you to the bench. Here, yeah, race for lower half. No, nah, doodle, Bob. He don't hold back. If you have such attachment, I will let you watch what happens next. You'll be summoned soon, my friend. He straight up got rid of him. You know, that wasn't easy, Patrick. Rest assured, this will take but a moment. Oh no, he's gonna get colorized. I am a sportsman, so my style of execution shall be fencing on guard. And what do we have, huh? The fists, the knuckles. Oh, it's showtime, let's go. Don't be bullcrap mechanics. We're in, defeat Dual Patrick. Let's see what you got, huh? Bring him closer, hey? What you got, bro? <laughs> nah, okay, right, so he draws, all right, watch. I think that hit me again. Okay, so that's the attack sequence. Here we go. He's blocking, he's blocking, so now we back up. Okay, so do we go? Oh, oh, oh dang, all right, I'm seeing this now. So there's a point after like here, he tries to hit us, and now we're running, okay? One, two, knuckle my shoe. Back up, here we go. So he tries it. Oh, the range got much bigger then. So let him do his on guard thing. I think we gotta like dust with it. Okay, dodge this. All right, here we go, he's gonna attack, and he misses. Now we've run in. Okay, we don't run in. Okay, run in, one, two, Three. Oh, these attack plans are strange. Ooh, yeah, we always back off far. Okay, so we can dodge the jabs, guys. Check this out, look. It's a jab. Oh, yes, you didn't hit us. That's a swipe. Oh, no, oh, no, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no time for that. How did he get hit, though, when he was doing... Okay, that was a jab. Okay, another jab. Let's see what he got now. It's a swipe. Then we run in always after the swipe. Okay, that's three phases, but we got more this time. Many more. Let's hit with a swipe. Let's see, what's the next one? Move in, move in, move in. Let's go. Oh, yes! Okay, let's walk back up as far as we can. Always. Woo! Okay, that's four. I don't know how many times we do this, but we'll learn. Okay, that's not a swipe. 
Okay. Okay, then he misses. Let's go. Five. Let's go. One, two, three. Bro, oh, why is our artwork like that? <laughs> why is that down here? Oh, we got some explaining to do. Let's see. Okay, bring him closer. Okay, he's drawing, he's drawing, so dodge right or whatever. Let's see. Swipe one. What's he doing now, huh? Let's see. We back up, we back up. He's going back. Now we go, and this is six. One, two, three. Okay, we're going good so far. This is working. This is attempt two. So this is real promising. Let's see. Okay. What the freak? Whoa, what's going down? What? Oh my god, I don't like this. I don't... What the freak? Uh, okay. I didn't like that one, sir. Okay, I'm running in. Have I got time? Let's go. Okay. That's seven. We're still not done, though. Okay, range attack. Maybe we want to bait him. All right, let's see. Okay, bring it in. Okay, no, not good. All right. Yes, let's go. Okay, one, two. Oh. Okay, that's A. He's still not. He wants to fight more, though. Okay, let's see. What are you going to do? Okay, go in, go in. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. You gotta be close. Oh! Oh, yes! Sit down! Sit down! Dang, that was much more successful. So, Doodle Patrick, he's down. But is the man done? What's so laborious about sharing the town? Why can you have given us a chance? Uh, I know. You tried erasing my friend, SpongeBob. Go under the bridge, right? No. I apologize. <laughs> Surely we can attempt some form of coexistence. Granted, I've tried killing you multiple times. Perhaps what I'm really seeking is compassion. Can you enlighten your coexisting scribble? Rick, you're trying to lull me into a false sense of pity, right? Patrick's brain is working when we need it. <laughs> but my ankles are. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! At least you caught on to my ruse, but rather late, don't you think? Uh, what about compassion friendship? <laughs> my only friend abandoned me for a sketch you nailed at those conjured. He's backing him up into the corner. <laughs> Who was there to console Bob as he sent? <laughs> me! <laughs> Who had to bear his babbles of agony over his deeply <laughs> departed? <laughs> me! Who felt they had a duty to right the inevitable wrongs developed by you camp for <laughs> brains? <laughs> me! But please, do enlighten me. Aren't you the shining example of a good friend? If so, what kind of best friend ruins a collector's card? How about the time you left your friend in a ringer, only to be ridiculed by society? <laughs> Oh, he's bringing out the deep ones. Your temporary royalty really was a crowning achievement. <laughs> oh, how could I forget the time when you gloated about your poorly earned license? Only to cause havoc in the town, mind you, with SpongeBob becoming increasingly aggressive. Dare I say, you deserve a repossession on that waste of metal you call a ring, you fool. Dang. Oh! Dude, we just crapped out of our mouth, though. <gasps> Great barrier reef! Oh, with the torch in hand. Listen, buddy, I've got a few things to tell you. First off, my, my name's not Rick. Secondly, I don't know what Frenchie told you, but you need to shut up. Go take that directory. Dictionary. Take that dictionary and give yourself a paper cut. But I'm made of paper. Shut up! And see, I know that at some point I wasn't a friend to SpongeBob. I was a bully, and now I'm a friend with many regrets. No amount of acceptance will relieve my guilt for the poor guy. Last thing I need is an idiot like you to hammer it in. If there's one thing I hear a lot, it's that I'm a big dummy. I'd rather be stupid than a smarty pants like you, so my life isn't a constant tragedy. Mm. We're both alike, you know. Surely not. We failed as friends, and no matter how hard we try, it just isn't good enough, is it? Mm. I Whoa. see. Unlike you, though, I would never lay a finger oh. on SpongeBob. What kind of friend are you if you don't trust each other? This is an outrage. You can't erase me. Even if you must have the capacity, I'll find a way to come back. I swear on it. I wouldn't make any more promises you can't keep, buddy. That is fire under the ocean. How is this possible? I've been asking these questions for a long time. Oh. Huh? Beats me. Mm. Now, what was I gonna do again? Discuss our relationship over a spot of tea? <laughs> I thought you were quick to catch a rumors. Oh, oh, straight where it hurts the most! That ain't being put out, dude, and we got fires rolling underwater. Mm. You got nothing. You put this, surely oh. you must have. Oh, uh, no, not really. Oh, uh, fair enough. Oh, wow. Burn to a crisp. No one's here to help you, sir. No one's here to help you. Let's go. We did it. So, we've probably got SpongeBob and Krusty Krabs missions left. Maybe? Oh, he's still dodging left and right. And they got Bob. <laughs> Come on right now, man. All right, guys, we got to squad up. Covering that barrier. They ain't coming through. Ooh, we got time to run over. Patrick should probably come too, though. What are you waiting for, boy? Throw that guitar over here. Good shot. Okay, nice catch. Oh, we're hitting the notes. We're hitting the notes. Wait, how far are we through this? It feels like we're getting to the end, though. Like, actual end of the end chapter. Let's see. Oh, no way. Oh, Squidward, you need your clarinet right now, sir. <laughs> no way. We need that sweet victory, right, guys? We need that sweet victory. Ooh. SpongeBob, we got the GG. Let's go. Get ready. Put my face there. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, show him some notes. Okay, we can't. Let's go, guys. So, we have to attack this guy, but we gotta wait. Okay, 
Oh, whoa, let's double jump. So we got the power to double jump, guys. You see the mirror on the right, though? That's gonna charge up fully before we do anything. Let's go, keep our distance, keep our distance. Let's go back, here we go. Oh, oh, this is cool, I like this one. So, dude, how much, how much mass you got left, though? It should probably be done. He's tired, but we can't do anything. Come on, this guitar has to charge up real soon. Uh, okay, back to this, no problem, no problem. Look at that dodge work. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that is- wait, that's us! Oh, okay, we got hit, that's fine. I'm living and learning, guys. Okay, so, what's this double jump? Oh, yes! Devil May Cry, down a star with that double jump. Okay, so, oh, he's spewing overhead now. Keep it moving. Uh, let's try far distance. It feels like that's the solution when it comes to dodges like that. You know that level we played as Patrick where I struggled? That taught me well, I think. Keep it moving. What next, huh? What next? Same attack? Oh, you're tired. <laughs> yeah, we're good, we're good. Oh, oh yes! Okay, he hits the slam every time. So, double jump this again. Oh, this is cool. Okay, two hits down. Same strap. Oh, no. Holy crap. All right, I see that, I see that. All right, now we're playing. Oh, my. All right, whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, that hit me. I jumped into it, that's why. Come on, guitar, charge. Let's go, wave three. Oh. Okay, we did hit him. Oh, that slow motion took me out. What's going on? That slow motion got me killed. No, man. Wait, what? I was moving though, what did he- I didn't even see what he did, oh sorry. Oh, okay, well that's not good, I didn't see those at all. He's changing up his attacks a lot then with this one. Oh dang, okay, now he's tired, we gotta be very wary though, what's this? Okay, start jumping now, okay, let's go. So, now we jump. Wow, this is definitely more difficult than I was expecting though. It is a final boss, so that's cool. Alright, let's go, fire. Now, okay, good, good, good. Alright, it's only two down. Ooh, I see that, I see that. Woo! Okay, let's see if we can get him a third time. I don't think so this time, but it's all good. What is this? What the freak am I seeing? He's got his own minion field. What the freak? Uh, I'm trying to watch what he's doing. Okay, it's down with this. So he's gliding around this thing now. Oh, I see. Keeping as far distance as he can from me. Yeah, that only works so long. Him. Right there. All right, that's wave three. So we did three times last. All right, what's he doing? What's he doing? It's hard to see. I'm watching out for, like, bear traps and stuff, too. Uh, what are you doing? What the freak are you doing? Uh, what the freak are you doing? I know what he's doing. What did that do? Nothing happened. All right, this is, uh, a bit... Okay, what the freak? How am I supposed to avoid this, though? Holy... Wait, he's up in the air now, then. Have we passed the first, like, phase of this battle? Maybe when you hit him three times, you enter, like, phase number two. Oh, he tries to cut me up. No, let's try this. I'm gonna jump more. Maybe? Like, <laughs> I don't know what's happening. You poor dudes, like, just laying on the floor. I feel bad for them almost, but then I don't, because I realize they're trying to kill me, so it feels kind of good. Keep your distance, keep your distance. Ah, here we go, fire. Oh, you're dead. You're not dead. You're just hurt. Okay, now let's try and figure out which way he goes. Or what, what's, what's he doing? It's about following his pattern. I think he only sticks to the far edges. So we can, like, cut in a bit. Like, oh, God, I see that. Okay, be wary, be wary, be wary. Watch for those shockwaves, too. Okay, now I'm going to get across the middle a little bit. Here we go, guys. Here we go, here we go. Okay, I'm burning up. I'm burning up. I don't know what's happening. I can't, I can't see anything. What the freak is going on? Let's go with that guitar. Let's go. Fire, fire, boom. Okay, I was about to jump again. We hit him. But that one hit different though. But it didn't at the same time because he's still there. Right now. Oh, what's, he doing? what's 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 he doing? Listen, okay, this one. All right, we've done this many a times. No problem. No problem. Okay, that jump was delayed. Did not feel good. So maybe he works in different phases. There's no structure. It's just when you get to a certain phase, be ready. All right, guitar is basically good again. Let's go. Oh. Wait. Oh, now that one hit different. Are we? Don't tell me he's about to go to phase two. And if so, checkpoint, please. <sighs> That's a big shriek. Oh, it blasts SpongeBob off the stage. You good, man? You good? Uh, why are you laughing? We worked so hard for this. What's going on, Eugene? Come on, SpongeBob. Get up. Oh, no. He's looking at Pearl. Oh, Mr. Krabs. No, don't do it, man. Come on, Eugene. Squidward. Oh, dear Neptune, Eugene. SpongeBob's gonna die if we don't do something. Yep. I you me. First time I've ever read that in a Spongebob game. Oh, what? Yeah. With mayo, you halfwit. I want you to take the last of the mayo in this weapon and lather me. <laughs> I, I can't do that, Eugene. Oh, Listen, we can think of something else, surely. Surely me boy's going to die if we don't try. But what makes you think you're going to be able to stop that thing? Your mayo did nothing so far. I, it's how to shall us become resilient to damage. But from the inside, it's as vulnerable as ever. Oh, I think we see what's happening now. Look, me up. That's an order. Okay, okay, just stop calling it that. Please, for the love of goodness. I don't like it. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, he's approaching. Okay. <laughs> While coated. One last thing, <laughs> lad. Check upon Mr. Squarepants from time to time. And I relieve you of duty. Oh my oh. gosh, no way. Mr. Yep. Krabs, time to do what I do best. SpongeBob, toss me like a cat, or you're fired. Fired? <laughs> Throws it up there. Let's see what goes down. He's gonna jump inside that dude's mouth and play the guitar, right? This is it. Mm. He smiles, he nods. <laughs> and he goes without thinking another one. What does that even mean? I don't know. Oh my <laughs> gosh! Nothing to see Mr. Krabs so hold up! What are we hearing? Oh he realizes he's okay. Hello? Oh my gosh! The whole place is in tatters. We're still stuck down rock bottom. It's raining underwater as well as fire. Oh no! Oh, come on, man! Are we really about to end like this? Oh, this sucks, though. No! Are you serious? So we took down the jellions, but at what cost, man? One of the members gone. And you hear the noise in the back. Are there more? Because now it's not the time I want to mess with you. I'll throw hands with as many of you as I can. In honor of Mr. Krabs. Dang, so Eugene gave his life after all that. He knew it was the only way we took that thing down. One of them had to go in. And they literally did. Click anywhere to skip. Guys. That's literally the ending to this game. Eugene straight up ends his life. I ain't happy about that. It just transitions to a thank you for playing. I accidentally clicked, but... Is that literally the game though? No? Hold up, hold up, hold up. I see Eugene by my side. Now, hold up, before we go ahead and close up, I do think that there is an alternate ending. I believe being all of these missions here has something to do with it, because we've only beaten three of them. I don't know why it would unlock the secret ending. I might be wrong. Maybe there's a specific set of items that you have to collect throughout this game as you're going through. There are so many collectibles in each stage that you can see them down the bottom. Either way, guys, I can't believe I'm about to say this, but... That was the end of Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. We made it all the way up to 9 a.m. and we ended with quite literally a bang. We were stuck down rock bottom, but the way we were left on also a bit of a cliffhanger after all of that, it didn't quite sit right. And it makes me think that there's definitely an alternate ending within this game. I'm gonna be real, I'm not sure if I'm gonna go for it if it involves doing like hours upon hours of unlocking things. But either way, one thing I am gonna say is I never expected for this game right here to turn into a full series on the channel. Like I figured maybe you guys would enjoy an episode or two, but we are, I think, eight episodes into this thing and we've played it all the way through to the very end. I'm glad to know that you guys did enjoy this game and we're down just to go on another adventure together all the way through Bikini Bottom looking at good stuff and I had a real good time playing this. A couple of the levels towards the end did get a little bit frustrating with their mechanics. It was kind of hard to more so understand what you're supposed to do, especially that Sandy's Tree Dome one like oh my goodness that robot stalking us down literally millimeters behind and then not getting me. I don't know what was happening man but we took it down and that's what matters. Either guys this is what we're going to close off from this episode of a Around the clock at Bikini Bottom. This was the ending part. Fortunately, we did manage to get all the way through. But I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys thought of the game in its entirety. And let me know your thoughts on what happened to that ending right there. Maybe what might happen or what we do for that secret ending. Because I'll be checking the comments on this one. I definitely found myself getting much more involved with the characters than I thought. Like, at the start, it was kind of a meme game. We are just having fun in the SpongeBob world, just messing around. But towards the end, like, I was feeling that when Patrick and SpongeBob were talking and things like that. It was a good ending. And I felt for them characters in that situation. Alright though, guys. This is what we're going to leave this video here though anyway and this was the ending of around the clock at bikini bar man i really hope you have enjoyed this full series and this video here if you did why not drop me that like rating and hey if you're new around here why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here so thanks so much for watching this video guys of course I hope you did enjoy and i will of course see you on the next one